Hello, I'm Dr. Kathleen Wills, and I would like to talk with you today about fibrocystic breast disease. It's a very technical term for something that's actually not a disease. It's just that GPs have to allocate some kind of medical diagnostic code to get insurance for a disease. But actually, fibrocystic breasts are just fibrocystic breasts. Also, this is a condition that isn't necessarily going to lead to breast cancer. So automatically, a lot of women, anywhere between the ages of 25 to 65, they're doing your monthly breast exam and they find a bit of a lump. What do you do in this scenario? Do you panic? Of course, as women we all do if we feel something slightly abnormal. But did you know that usually only 5% of the time that this is really a cancerous condition? So there are many, many different reasons for fibrocystic breasts, and those can include anything from um, your menstrual cycle, so just before your cycle you might have a bit of breast pain or tenderness, and this is usually due to a lack of progesterone during that time of the month. So when your estrogen increases, your progesterone has an inverse relationship, so it decreases. And estrogen, when it increases, it can cause that swelling, et cetera, in your breasts, which can cause the tenderness and pain. So one thing we like to do at my Optimum Wellness Clinic in Epsom, New Zealand, is we like to treat people with bioidentical hormone therapies. And we can provide you with a progesterone cream that you actually rub onto the breasts, and that really relieves the tenderness and the pain that many women feel every month. Now another reason for fibrocystic breasts is um, a, a general kind of um, mastitic, mastitis. So this is a non-cyclical, meaning it's not having to do with your menstrual cycle. It occurs sometimes due to trauma, anatomy of the chest wall, um, or some kind of infection. So we need to look at that as well if you're having chronic breast pain that isn't related to, like, say, a week before you have your menstrual cycle. So this is a very interesting fact. In New Zealand, there's very little iodine in the soil. And because of that iodine deficiency, that can affect our thyroid and how we produce hormones in our body, thyroid-stimulating um, hormones. With this, this can actually affect the fibrocystic condition of your breasts. If you're lacking iodine, this can give you um, higher estrogen and it can increase the potassium in your breast and cause these painful kind of cysts. So I would also check your thyroid and we have special tests to check your iodine. So we can check if you're deficient in iodine, which many people in New Zealand commonly are. So we would replenish the iodine um, with nutritional supplementation and therefore it would reverse that painful producing um, thyroid um, into potassium into the breast kind of painful process. So to sum up what we can do for you at Optimal Wellness um, regarding fibrocystic breasts is we can offer you bioidentical natural hormone therapies so first we would do a, a, an evidence-based lab work um, on your bloods and we would check how your thyroid is, what your hormones are like. Then we would actually do a complete breast examination. So you would come to me and I would do that in my office. And I would also recommend to you some really good effective herbal therapies that have been well researched. Such things as yarrow, erva ursi, cleavers, um, and pokey root, which can be rubbed into the breast for um, relief of pain. Nutritional supplements that I would offer as well that are very helpful for this condition, vitamin E, omega-6 fatty acids, like evening primrose oil. This is a fantastic supplement. But you can get this at the supermarket, but I would recommend um, a physician's um, consult to really get the effective dose. Vitamin A, beta carotene, and iodine as we talked about before. I'd also check out your dietary um, kind of modifications, tweaks here and there. So avoidance of caffeine, increase your fruits, vegetables, and whole grains, decrease your uh, intake of saturated fats, 
and um, also intake your um, seaweed and seafood because that's really rich in natural iodine. So if you'd like to make an appointment and start getting relief from this fibrocystic breast condition, tenderness, pain in the breasts, you can ring Optima Wellness Clinic and ask for Dr. Kathleen Wills for an appointment, 09-623-6234. Or you can also find me online at Kathleen at DrKathleenWills.com. I'm available by in-person and Skype appointments. Thank you.